My name is Paris and I am a 31-year-old mother of two. At the age of 26, I was diagnosed with MND. So how am I playing video games with my children? My name is Sinead and I'm a computer science student at University College London. I came onto this project when Professor Dean shared his ideas on a project in which users could interact with digital devices without the need to use their hands. Working as a professor of computer science, we were amazed by the technological advancements our students were making with motion input and decided to invite mentors from Intel, IBM and Microsoft to provide guidance which has proven invaluable. He tasked us to create something that would really make a difference to people's lives. An application that could give those with fine motor skill conditions opportunities that typically abled people take for granted. We knew motion input was the answer, but there were still so many questions. We agreed straight away that we needed this application to function universally on any Intel-based machine without the need to purchase expensive, bespoke peripherals or alter third-party code. OpenVINO was the breakthrough. We settled upon a grid-based hybrid facial navigation technology that could trace the user's eyes or head movement to control the mouse pointer whilst an action like opening or closing the mouth or raising their eyebrows could be mapped to a mouse button click. Motion input isn't just confined to facial movement. Hand gesturing using Windows touch points could be utilized anywhere from schools to hospital surgeries. With a simple Intel-based machine and webcam, motion input could lead to massively increased population health benefits or even utilized in care homes where the elderly, who may previously have struggled with grasping objects with their hands, could play online games like chess with their friends or family. Imagine you had a condition where you found physical movement challenging. Maybe you had a motor neuron condition or were a patient confined to a hospital bed. The potential for motion impact to change lives is limitless. 